Hello, YouTube. Uh, today, I will be showing you how to play backup PS1 games on a PS2. Uh, it works pretty much the same for both Slimline and Fat, but, uh, Fat, you need a special tool, of course, which is easy to make for free. So, here we go. Here is my TV. Okay, yes, I have two TVs. Uh, one's HD and the other one, this one's HD too. It's got component input. Check it out. It's input three that can go component. So it's HD, I get some HD channels too. But uh, I have my PS2 plugged into uh, the component part. So here we go, here's my PS2. I have Tekken 3, burned copy, burned it today. Uh, yes, I have the uh, actual Tekken 3 also, but I'm not using it because the disc is pretty much dying. So, what you do, you take your burned copy, set it aside for now, don't need it right now. And I like to use... Crash Bandicoot 2 as my uh, my boot disc, so to speak. So, as you can see, I've got my sensors taped up. This one is accessible because uh, when you're booting it, you don't want to have the, that sensor blocked. And I have the uh, the disc brake lever blocked over here with a piece of paper and some tape. So now, you take your real PS1 disc, take it, put it in there, power the system on with the uh, power sensor unblocked. So now it's going to start up up here. Alright, so once it's up on this menu, you select a browser. Alright, now here comes the tricky part. After you, uh, when you're in browser, you have to stick the sensor back down, as I just did there, and it starts spinning now. It comes up on the screen here. You highlight the disc, all right? Don't press anything. Press something now and you'll mess it all up. So from this point, once you have the disc highlighted, come down to your system here. Well, first, you want to have your, uh, your other disc case open so you're able to grab it quickly. So now I'm going to have to double hand this. Okay, so while the disc is spinning and you're still in the browser menu and it's still highlighted, take the disc out and you put your PS1 disc in, your burnt game. So now up here it still hasn't changed. Burnt game, okay. Crash Bandicoot 2 is right here. It's out of the system. That is a burnt game. That's not the disc to uh, Tekken 3. So now you have it up here. You start the game. And it should start up just like any other game, you know, just like it was the real deal. Yeah. See? Give it a second. I want to I want to show you guys the actual menu when it boots up, so you know I'm not just yanking your chain. I don't believe in lying. It's wrong. It's just wrong. So you can bet that everything I say about this is absolutely true. It does work. It does not work for PS2 games, though. I could not get it to work. If you can, more power to you, but it doesn't work for me for PS2 games. Only PS1 games. This is Tekken. See? Get the video here. Shut up. Here we are. Second three menu. It is the actual game. Now I'm playing this one handed here, so I'm obviously not going to be very good. Gotta hold the camera as well. 
One-handed gangsta. Damn it! Get up! Get up, Yoshimitsu! Don't make me bitch slap you! Damn it! One-handed chicken. But yeah, that's the game. And it does work. I am still playing the burnt copy. I'm not yanking your chain. This does work. <laughs>